Hi, my name is Phil from Got Memories, and I digitize videotapes to files, USB, old home movies. Now, I've been doing this for 20 years. Over the last couple of years, there's been one particular company that has had a massive, massive presence in this industry. And they are nationally promoted by celebrities. They're on The View, QVC, Dave Ramsey, Howard Stern. And they are digitizing tapes. Huh. Well, they're not. They put stickers on tapes telling people that their tapes, due to environmental issues and mold and so on and so forth, that their tapes are blank and nothing can be pulled off them. And they keep their money. But for the few that find me on YouTube, and I've got a lot of videos on YouTube about this, the few that find me and then get a second opinion, ship me their legacy box boxes, and then I take the tapes with the stickers on them that look, they tell them there's nothing on them, put them in a regular VCR, and they play perfectly fine. Now, the reason that this is happening, this customer here, so many tapes, precious memories that you know, his dad is on this tape. And this one particular tape is all he's got, memories of his dad. And then he's told, you know, it's blank. And the reason why this is happening is because for you guys in the industry, remember the old uh, decks and everything, these heads need to be cleaned and replaced. And they do not do that. They just put a tape in and it's snow and they go, whoop, the customer's tape's bad. No, your players are knackered. They don't clean the tapes. They don't do anything. They just put these stickers on them and send them back. People get heartbreaking news and they're charged for it at the same time. And then they give them to me and they play absolutely fine. Um, this happens again and again and again. And it needs to be told. This story is, is just, it could be, it's, it's huge. And it's just so... Um, morally wrong, and this company spends millions of dollars a year on ad spend with Facebook and everything. As some of you watching this might have even heard of this company, um, and they're just terrible. It's a chop shop, it's a scam, and these people are having their hearts broken. For the few people that find me, great, they get their stuff rectified, um, but for a lot of people, they just throw these tapes away when they're perfectly fine. Um, so the heartbreak going on and the frustration and the disbelief that a nationally, uh, you know, promoted company through celebrities and, you know, well-known networks um, is just completely and utterly taking the piss and um, not even cleaning their heads and just telling people their stuff is, um, you know, bad. And they get a booklet with it. And it's all very well done. Um, you know, very, looks professional. I mean, you know, it, it's well done. These are the owners right here. You know, they got a write up on them. They talk in the ads about their story and about, you know, they even quote Socrates in here somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, come on. And you can't clean your video heads and you're telling people with their home movies that they're gone. And you're keeping them money. Anyway, this is a story. I'm willing to go on camera. Uh, this needs to be told. Um, and I do have customers that probably would be more than willing as well to uh, go on camera and tell their story. But this is just, it's so wrong and it boils me. Um, and even the tapes that they do transfer, they put stickers sometimes on them saying that due to this, that, and the other, the digital copy is bad. And then I get, like, this is one tape, I mean, just an example. This is my copy here, redo here. And then this is the customer's uh, copy. So this is them. This is ticking right now. And it's just... And then it just becomes uh, just this. When there's, like, a whole slew of home movies and all customers are getting back is hour and 55 minutes of blue screen and snow um and that and then they tell them no it's your tape i mean this is a, a carbon copy redo job and it just is 
this just it blows my mind. I, I, again, the words can't quite come out properly. But anyway, my name's Phil. You can reach me at um, Phil, P-H-I-L, at gotmemories, G-O-T-M-E-M-O-R-I-E-S dot com. Um, and you can call the number at 602-438-4381. All right, cheers.